Emeritus Professor Kwabnang Ketia is considered Africa's premier ethnomusicologist and a foremost champion of African tradition in contemporary times. On the occasion of his 96th birthday celebration, he was eulogized for his contributions to Ghana's traditional music and a promoter of African tradition. The president, Nana Ekufado, was a guest at the celebration. He described Meritus Professor Nketia as a standard for music around the world. These are some of the works of Emeritus Professor J. H. Kwabena Nketia. Emeritus Professor J. H. Kwabena Nketia is one of the world's most respected authorities on African music. His concept and interpretation of African rhythm has been influenced in academia and are performed around the world. His innovations are widely used by scholars to transcribe African music. Born in the Ashanti region, Emeritus Professor J. H. Kwabnan Kitia schooled in prestigious institutions throughout the world, from the University of London, Bergbeck College, the Trinity School of Music, the famous Jullard School, where he studied musicology and composition. Emeritus Professor Nketia is a renowned Africanist, ethnomusicologist, composer, poet, linguist, and sociologist. He was the first African director of the Institute of African Studies and also of the International Center for African Music and Dance. His academic across the academic circles, he has also written a number of books, predominantly on African culture and music. In 2015, a first drift was outdoored at the Institute of African Studies, IAS, in its honor. Celebrating his 97th birthday, scholars, businessmen and friends came together to eulogize one of Africa's illustrious sons, Professor Emeritus Joseph Hansen Wablankitia, who has distinguished himself as a true Pan-Africanist, not only on the African continent, but also across the globe. The African University College of Communications, AUCC, has honored him with the Kobna Inkitia Center, a center dedicated to the study of African tradition. His body of work urges us to understand, appreciate, and embrace our culture, to respect and honor our traditions, and to preserve our traditions. In so doing, there is something even greater that awaits us a rebirth similar to the journey of national pride that our forefathers embarked on with our independence more than 60 years ago. Emeritus Professor Koblen Kitia disclosed the drive behind this love for African music and tradition. The thing about studying some other people's cultures is not to imitate those cultures, but to use the experience of learning other cultures to create your own. So at this stage, in my life, I'm sort of still hoping that I have people who are not just uh, pleased with uh, the oratoria and other things that we learn from our, uh, Europe, but will create uh, the same kind of oratoria thing in Ghana. President Akufuado said the life and achievements of Emeritus Professor Kwabena Nketia over the past 96 years should inspire Ghanaians to do more for the country. Professor Nketiah's achievements are worth celebrating because they give us formidable cultural capital to fortify our unique African identity, forge a great Ghanaian nation, and pursue our historic Pan-African vocation. His life work is a great message for the youth that the sky is the limit for anyone who wants to work hard. He has given us the gilded marbles retrieved from the past, and it is our duty to incorporate them in the architecture of our culture and national identity going forward. The occasion was used to raise funds to support the Kwabna Nketiah Center for African Studies at the AUCC.